Find anything good? Nah, I... I'm watching. Got it? He's gonna drive I the get boss? it. Nah, you don't lose your job, some kind of problem? I hate sitting around. Born as hell. You're good for talk. That don't mean you could get a little. Does he stop the grumpy? What do you think I gotta do to... See. Think you shouldn't ask me, Carlo. Not gonna give a good answer. Anyways, I, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take it of Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. We make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. We're grateful for his dough, but we gotta go. Long drive back north. Joan of Vincenzo. Ciao, Polly. Oh, she's gonna sing. <laughs> Who's this then? Benny. This here's Tommy Angelou. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or ruts? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This classic should do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Aye, aye, aye. Oh, careful careful with them, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Todd. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. Ralphie's in the garage. He's a special kind of idiot, but he's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets interest of her. But I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black man. Oh, what's up, Nina? I was just finna text you. Hey, genius! <laughs> how you doing today? Polly, you can't, 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 can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really good game. We ain't nothing like. You got that, Ralph? Sh -sh -sh sure, Papa Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. G good to meet you. Like I said. Ralphie here is a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, I'll make it yours. Tom and me, this isn't the original in. version. Um, the original else. version came out in 2000, 2000 yeah, something. I think it's before I was born. It was on the PS2. This is the remake of it, though. Let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> One day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. I don't know what Ralph's trying to pull giving us this motor. I wanna show you something about the good life and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. You don't have to be nice about it. Spins a tin cab! So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop-off. The cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you got a torch, he's got more friends on the force than us. But we're okay, so long as we're careful. Keep an eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through, you want a bottle, just ask. Keeps them back for friends. Ah, I'm no big drinker. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. Who us? You got a line in the good stuff. But it's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The 
games they got in these places. Best tables, best food, best skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to send fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. Hey, it's their cars huh? we're wrecking today, not this junker. Get on to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri's streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work. Hey, oh it's crap, their move out the way. Today, not this junker. I know. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk in a wrong part of town. You start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. Okay, it's close by. What? Well, let's go and face that, but okay. I'll get up. Motors out back. There's some lazy bastards. We put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. We gotta sneak in and wreck the car. Send a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. Okay. Go quiet. You know how to go quiet, right? Yeah, like that. Yeah, he's got his big guys. This is going quiet. No one sees our heads. No one tries to pop them. Gate and up onto their roof. I'll go through uh, their chunk busy while you creep up and jump in from behind here. Get real good at distracting. Uh, boss, we got plenty of guys in the city me. real pissed. Actually, careful. As I get the money on uh, Hey! What the hell are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I mean, oh. what I say. What the hell are you doing back there? Who are you? A guy who don't know what idiot told you to keep look out here. Dino. Yo, what's Dino up, Nunu? Dino? Dino? <laughs> like that. Got it. How you doing today? Now let's get to these cars. Take your bat and start swinging. You just got done slaving for the white man. Throw some fire. Oh. What the? Love your work. That weak throw. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Whole block heard that. We gotta go. We can take Dino's car. How'd you know this is Dino's car? I don't like you, and you got a good car? You just now getting off, though? Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. Ah, crap, the police coming. He's right here, Morello's place. Don't bring in the wrong people. Straight through the gate. We gotta get out of here before the bulls show. They're shooting. Don't let them get away. Come back, you bastards. What's wrong, move? Ah, shit. Oh, we got cops. So, uh, what do we do? You lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. 
Sounds good. Right now, they can't really pissed. drop real fast in the car this hole. Okay, we lost them. Stay out of sight till they lose interest. Oh, this is one up here on the way. Yeah. Stay out of sight. Wasn't clear. I don't know. Drive safe. They're still looking for us. Holy thing on catching me. This one right in front of me. Die, Tom. Drive. No. Alright, there. There won't be no more. Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Silieri had cops on the books. Some street cops. Drive oh, careful. We don't oh, need the crap. attention. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How did it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. No time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? There's life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just yeah, asking life questions. Yeah, it's life for me. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. It's had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by, and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now, and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> well, what happened to the car I sent you out with? Dumped it. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. Up of a better car with a, a broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. My bad, that's my fault. I didn't mean to break that window. He just got apples on the ground like that. You still with you then? Somehow. Yeah. Hey boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not gonna be able to think straight for weeks. See? That's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morello is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You yeah, that? I'll play. Um, I'll do a couple of missions, honest. then I'll get on Fortnite. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. All right, I see all right here. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm going to only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. 
And they don't keep Frank on the payroll because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? Loyalty. They're loyal. That's right. Now you stay straight with me, you're gonna be living the high life, Tom. But you abuse my trust. Don Celieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Yeah, I know what happened to folks who snitched. Okay, then. It ain't gonna be good. Welcome to the family. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's eat. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook. But his daughter Sarah, Maron. Those first days in Celieri's bar was slow. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly we just waited. I got to thinking. Maybe life in Celieri's crew wasn't gonna get me Dang, I ain't letting nobody slam me like that. But what did I know? You Tommy? Come on, this yeah. Boss is waiting What's it for you. Thanks. And it's collection day, boys. So, Tommy, you'll drive. Paulie and Sam can handle the rest. It'll be routine. Just a handful of stops today. Bill at the motel was a little short last month. We'll make sure he pays us the interest he owes. No problem, boss. Don't lay hands on anyone unless there's no other choice. Our clients need to understand that we provide a valuable service. They need to look at you and see Santa Michael. They need to believe they'll protect them. So let Morellis look to breaking legs. We're better than We'll protect them as the long as they got do, that money. And everyone pays up. We can handle it. Go see Ralphie about a car. Okay, boss. Oh, I ain't sucking on that cigar. <laughs> Head to him first. You do? Probably just wants to tell you some bullshit story about some guy he whacked 20 years ago. Hope he ain't finna throw me like he did on other place. The guy. Vincenzo. I saw this. And I thought of you. Wow. Oh. You ever carry a rat? Oh, snub, man. I've been there a couple of times. <laughs> right. They don't count. Pointed at the target over there. Good posture. Real mean. Bang. Brain off the walls. Okay. Now show me a reload. I'm gonna paint them with it. Open the chamber and away you go. All right. Last thing needs to be hidden. Stick it in your belt. Good to go. When shooting starts, get behind some and don't shit yourself. Thanks, Vincenzo. I appreciate it. <laughs> hey, the Frank and the boss, is Vincenzo. To you, it's Vinny. All right, I'm gonna see you later, Vinny. My cousin Vinny. Look, you guys need to be careful today, okay? I spoke to Biff. He said Morello's still bent since we Ralphie! You, you, you know how to get, get, get into one of these, Tommy? Elbow goes through. Reach inside. Easy. And then afternoon to f f f fix the window back up. Watch. 
And... Water. You're a regular magician, Ralph. Okay, then, well, well. Show me what you can do. Okay, it's a car. Okay. Okay. Have a good day, Buffa fellas. First, we got Al. He runs a bakery on Longman Street. You know it? Yeah, I know it. Al's late again. Oh, Longman so. Street. <sighs> That's too bad. That is the first drift ever recorded. And this is historically accurate, so I'm claiming that oh yeah. Yeah, I invented drifting. I went back in time so I can invent drifting. <laughs> oh that's an oh an arrow. Oh we got it. Is that a cop? Oh no 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 no. This is it. Watch what we do today, Tom. When it goes smooth, it's a breeze. When they put up a fight, sometimes you gotta think on your feet. Sure. Just follow my lead. Alright. Sam, Polly, how are you? We're good. How's what it do? So little now, she's turning into a pain in the ass, just like her grandma. That's good to hear, Al. Real good. Now you got any trouble oh. around here? Any punks causing problems? No, no. Nothing like oh, that. Nice looking good. bread you got here. You got, got some raisin bread? I got, it, uh, in the back. got some cinnamon oh, raisin Tommy bread? It. You stay here where we can see you. It's been real slow this month, Sam. I was worried that we wouldn't I... have enough. Al. I know you can't kind of excuses, but it's good you worry. I mean, how can we protect you and little Julia? Where my money at? You gonna get the dough or what, Tom? Where's Dang, the money? you can't say it. What did you say to me, ma'am? All right, you lucky. Via di qui, the shot that you bought. Alright now, I'll shoot you. I got it. See you next month, Al. Let us know if you need anything. Anything at all. Sure will, Sam. Sure will. Yo, we gonna take hey, care of it. Best, your mom, huh? Come on, Sam. What you walk? So slow, folks. Damn. Okay, next up, we got old Eugene's place. Chinese store up on Tallow. He's not dead yet? Almost. Heard his nephew's taking over. We need him a lot. That's my business. Down. His name's not Eugene. Yeah. The guy's a Chinaman. But it sounds like Eugene. Well, that's what we called him. Polly slammed his head into the counter back in. What, 27, I think? <laughs> yeah, it was hilarious. After that, no problems at all. And if you look, you can still see the blood. Poor old bastard couldn't scrub it out. That, that's elder abuse. That, that ain't cool. We don't do that. that. There in our city, not theirs. But we don't know Eugene's nephew. So we don't do that. Need reminded, too. Move, get out the road. Come on, what the horn sound like? <laughs> oh, snap, my bad, folks, my bad. I'm new to town, not really. 
Excuse me. Hey, oh. Ralphie, I said. Tom sure can drive. No working after hours, cleaning up after me and Sam. <laughs> no chance of that, huh? Yep. <laughs> How you get... You know what? Not gonna question it. My bad. I ain't got insurance. I don't think we have this car insurance it. back here. Holy part right here. I'll cover this one, Sam. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. He's doing the store on his own? Yeah, when Polly's built up a little steam, he needs to let it out on his own. She gotta let him get on with it. It's his way. But you mean get on voice. with it? Gotta let him lone wolf from time to time. Keeps him huh? happy. Yo, yeah, what are you doing in there? You ain't I thought we were supposed right to now. serve and protect, well, not, <laughs> not you beat him up. Once we were putting a squeeze on this tailor over in Holbrook, guy ended up in a wheelchair. We supposed? How he's? Pro All right. I don't see this as protection. I see this as abuse and harassment. Here he comes. He's a fast worker. Yeah, he is fast. A violent too. Yeah, ma'am, I'm blaming you for running. Time. We are horrible next people. Next bill at the motel. Eugene's nephew's right, guy's man. money is ours next week with some extra besides. He doing oh, okay? Hell. He's okay. How's the shop counter? Yeah, that's seen some more blood. How much blood? And eh, nothing he can't scrub out. Once he's back on his feet. Bro, we ain't ever getting climbed. <laughs> We got like a negative. We got negative stars on yo. Chinese nephew guys scrubbing their own blood out of shop counters. Yeah, seems like it's not too hard. Not hard. Yeah, it ain't that bad. Kind of not hard. I don't know. Comes natural to you guys. Don't see why it can't come natural to me. So anyone could do this. Me and Polly. Yeah. We've been working these streets for years. You come in and you think you know it all. I'm not saying that. I so do. Like, You've been a day on the job, pal. You haven't seen what we do. You haven't seen how we do uh, it. Sam, I think uh, you ought to... No, Polly. This punk thinks he can walk in here like a big shot. I put greasers like him in the ground. I think you gotta say you're I, sorry, Tom. I will sorry, crash his uh, boat. Well, I'd say sorry if I couldn't see the bullshit smile you're trying to hide. <laughs> you got him, though, Sam! You got him! Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna kill us. I can smell the crap in your pants from here. Nah, you didn't get me. <laughs> when little Tony first came out with us, I had him on his knees before he knew I was yanking his chain. <laughs> yeah, you did better than him anyways. Taste the freshness of Big Great White. Big Great White? Huh? Jesus. I hate the freshness. Oh, city. hell no. You hate it most places. Yeah, but out here it's worse. How come there's a place so nice far out, out of town on our books? Is that a blimp? Our town's the safest place for deals. The safest place for card games. The safest place for most of the things we do. We're expecting a big bag of money today. The guy owes. If it ain't big, Dang, the that's like a pissed. Yeah, this PS place is a real area. Right there. <laughs> Oftentimes, the places that get you the most dough are the ones most people don't look at twice. Just recently, the motels had a new lease of life. Last stop before I lost Tevin for rum coming up from Cuba. They drive it this far? Sure they do. And that's how we can sell it so expensive. Really? Hills Motel has gotten to be the place where crates get exchanged. Oh, so they go on all the way from Cuba. He lets the other families use it too. Even in New more, York? To keep the peace? That's a little sure. Plus, it's far enough away that no one cares. So long as everyone's making money, no one's gonna rock the boat. I guess. Anyone else starting to miss the side of streets and sidewalks? You not one for the great yeah. outdoors, Polly? He's not one for anything. Indoors, Dang, outdoors, what's wrong with your wheel?
Why is we smoking at a gas pump? That ain't smart. You gotta get. Yeah, wrap it up. Oh, man. Oh. Bro, what happened to you? Oh, shit. Tell Salieri from here on out, this place is ours. Capish? And don't come back, or you'll end up in worse shape I than bet. your friends. Ah, oh, Fred. What is that? Man? I gotta get you to a doctor. Right. I can wait. Get Sam out of there. Okay. Okay, just hang on. Hey, what my what my piece at, bro? You ain't gonna kidnap my homie like that, huh? Oh, need to go in quiet. We gotta be smart about this. Here for y'all. Oh, shit, shit, y'all don't hear me. Where you go? Is that? A oh, that's a hog. What you doing, in here, boy? What you doing? Go to sleep. Yeah, yeah. Ain't nobody making. Clear. Next time I'll tell him. I'll tell him I had enough of this bullshit. Oh, you did? Hmm. Oh, you is? Hey, 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 hey. Ah, oh, crap, crap, crap. Hey. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Man. What is wrong with you? Crazy, bro. Oh, oh shit. See, man, why you make me kill you? Man, I am not scared of you. Yeah. Reba Dirty. Ah, oh, damn, I ain't stuck. Ah. Uh. Ain't nobody playing pool today. I'm coming, Sam. Sam, oh, they really went to work on you, buddy. Christ. Uh, come on, you'll be all right. You're tough as nails. Oh. Uh. That, yo, that mm. when he got in the bag. Uh, he's got the money, Tom. Oh, catch the bastard. I'm coming for you. Where is Sam? He's okay. He in Inside. there. Hey, go get the money. I am dying. Come on. Oh, that's the down. Oh, did you shoot at me? Move! Oh, boy, he is dead. I just killed him. Steer the other way. Dang, they had to make the sound real. No way. Mind your business. Mind your business. This don't involve you. Mind your business. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's that. Just that top tier driving right here. It's that cow bush driving.
Bruh, how many bugs I gotta put in you? Alright, I'm gonna ram it. Oh. Pull over now. Did you not understand the worst pull over? What it meant to be on the inside. Huh. I should have took off there and then. But I couldn't go back to being a nobody. Ow. Alright. Ordinary scene. Man, I hope it don't go like that. So that's how it really is. Intermezzo. Intermezzo. I don't know. Intermezzo. <laughs> Didn't oh. feel that way at the time. Me Don't look at hard work. The street. They can break just when Polly and Sam are coming around the corner. What are the odds? I felt like, I don't know, like someone was watching out for us. <laughs> Whatever helps you sleep at night, pal, but it's a lucky break all the same. I mean, one day you're busting your back, doing an honest day's work in a city that's been trying to scrape you off its heels since the day you stepped off the boat. And the next you're stuffing your pockets full of Salieri's dirty money. Right. And Lord and over the rest of us. Yeah, I wasn't like that. Man, like that all money dirty at Martin this City. point. For every buck Salieri made, Don Morello would turn ten. He paid off cops, politicians, judges, and anyone he couldn't buy. He scared into looking the other way. Everybody this got a price. A jumping in its own shadow, I'll give you that. You hear anything about Joey Crackers? Yeah, got his name in the Morello file, sure. Boxer. Joey Crackers. Yeah. That's the guy. What happened to Joey Crackers? Yeah, I hear it. Joey was just driving to the gym one morning. Got yeah. daydreaming about winning a belt or something. Put on gains in. Ah. Oh, Damn it! Moron! The gym with your goddamn eyes closed! Look at this. Bruh. Man, you don't mind shit up. Jesus, Mary. Joseph Dunn. Who's you? Tom Morello. I didn't know it was you. You know anybody else driving a rare import in this part of town, Joey? No. I was supposed to see. Well, I just know I, somebody hit me. I'm sorry. I, uh, I was driving real slow. You're saying this you know, is my was fault. No, you was no, hard. No, 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 sir. I, I just... I just... I, I ain't never been in no accident. Well... Repairs are gonna be expensive. <laughs> oh, you, you're not gonna need that. Hey, sir. what you finna do with that? Tires are just fine. His grills look bent up is all. I mean, I got a cousin. I got. Yo. So strong. Ah, dang. Police! Hell, police! That's a cool way to go. Uh, someone spun your tail, pal. You got an informant right there says Marilla made a mint every time Crackers went to the mat. That's true, too. And still, yeah. Marilla left that poor sap dead in the street. Head all caved in. On Town Square. Well, maybe the Don knew Joey's career was on the downhill. Or maybe he was trying to scare some other guy into paying up. Who knows? Don Celieri chalked it up to Morello not being able to think straight when he was mad. Th that's a possibility. You know, uh, hmm. Have any more run-ins with Morello's crew back then? Not at first. For a couple of years after I joined up, things were quiet. We got into a few dust-ups with guys trying to muscle in, but elsewise it was just the usual routine. We were running booze, offering protection, me and the boys doing rounds to collect small time. But I ain't gonna lie. Most days, we was also having a bit of fun. I don't play anymore. Hmm. Airplay. Tommy, thanks for getting down here so quickly. Yeah, sure thing, boss. What do you need? You know, That's there's a race God, coming. No problem. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Paulie yeah. and Sam have some money on uh, the local. Mikey Dunn. That's the guy. He's a good kid, but a bit of a scrapper. Not too smart with his money. 
few years ago, Mikey comes to me asking for a loan. He wants to get new tires so he can keep racing junkers out at the quarry. Mm -hmm. I like fast cars. I figured it'll be a bit of a hobby. Turns out, Mikey's a great investment. The kid can't lose a race if he walks the track. He graduates from the junkers to cow jobs, and I start placing a few bets on him here and there. Next thing I know, I've made all my money back and more. Hey, uh, Sam says he's the guy to beat. He was. We ran all the competition out of But now Ralph says there's a hotshot European entering the race, and he's got a car faster than our boys by a country mile. How much do we stand to lose? A truckload, but not just our outfit. A lot of guys from the neighborhood come to me for financial advice. They've all put money down on this kid. It'll be like Black Thursday around here if he loses. Well, for everyone Black except Thursday? Rome. No, you I know Black he's Friday. European? Oh, I'm certain of it. Is that when the stock market crashed? He wants something so. to happen to the driver. Can't find them. Merle's got him holed up somewhere safe. Besides, if he drops out or disappears now, none of our wagers will stand. Everyone will cry foul yeah. and say the race is fixed. What about his car? That's the ticket, Tommy. Ralph knows a guard at the track. You go down there tonight, you boost the European's car, bring it to one of our mechanics and make a few adjustments, you bring the car back. Should be no problem, boss.